So to explain corner orientation, this is the swapping algorithm, the modified Y permutation. So whatever is in here, this top facing sticker gets sent to whatever is on the right. And setup moves for corners, basically, instead of swapping, setting up to the top, instead you would swap, you would set up to this sticker. So let's say you want this to be swapped with this. For these two to be swapped, you could just do a D move because that would move this sticker to where it would be swapped. Now you can see that whatever piece, whatever sticker was just here, got sent up to the top. So you'll find corner, corner, corner setups and swapping to be a bit more complicated since corners can have three orientations instead of two, but setup moves should be just as intuitive and the same two move rule applies. And let's say you want to swap this the buffer piece with this bottom with this bottom sticker. Well, you by doing an F prime, you've set up this sticker to the right place on the right, so it can be swapped. So it can be swapped, and if you do the Y permutation, this white should end up at the top. Undo the setup move, and that's exactly what's happened. So let's say you want this to be swapped with this bottom sticker. Well, you can do then two moves, D prime, F prime. So you can see, so keep track of this because that's what you want to swap. So keep your, so keep a finger on it. And you can see it's moved to the right. Do the Y perm, undo it. You've swapped top to bottom. So undoing setup moves will probably be something that will take a while to get used to, but remember they are quite intuitive and you should not have to memorize them from a analog sheet. No, they're two, they're just two moves long, and yes, undoing the setups can be quite finicky. It just takes practice.